y'all was like, Dame, you gonna stop hating on Sonic driving. And I'm like, why? I mean, every time we done got food from there, it been a little sketch of ditch. And they always like, Dame, pull up. They got something new. You're gonna like it. I hope you're right. <laughs> You know me, man. I'm gonna go ahead and mess around. Get on the pool up over here at Sonic. Uh, bang bang. Thank you for choosing Sonic. What can I get to start for you today? Yeah, let me get your Chop House cheeseburger. Okay. Also, let me get your grilled cheeseburger. Uh, we don't sell the grilled cheeseburger. Okay, that's fine. Um, let me get your uh, churro shake. What size? Uh, let me get a medium. Okay. Also, I got tater tots. Okay. And a large Sprite. Okay. And that'll be all. 1651. Thank you. Yeah, buddy. What's going on, foodie fam? Real quick, while we're over here setting up, I just want to say I greatly appreciate everybody showing my very first food show series on my YouTube channel. Wild love, baby. Wild love, man. I greatly appreciate y'all. I greatly appreciate the feedback on the joint. Let's tighten that up, tighten that up. Um, it's called Eating Off Script for those that are unaware. It drops right here every Sunday, all right? Every single Sunday. So for the past two Sundays, because I have two episodes up, I dropped a new joint for you. The last one's called uh, Reviewing the Food from Jail. Because I was actually in the jail cell reviewing the food. It's kind of fresh up in that particular spot. But uh, we want to go ahead and mess around. Because of you, fam, because of you, we're back at Sonic. Because you know if it was left up to me, I'd never come back up over here for their food. For new drinks, yes, because i said this a million times before, Sonic's drink game is on Smash. We all know when it comes to their ice creams, they get exotic and wild with the flavors. Ice creams, slushies, everything's amazing. Their food, not so much. But it doesn't mean that I'm not going to come back at the food. He says, Dame, yo, the Chop House cheeseburger, don't play yourself. Mm. And you don't play yourself. Uh, fam, could somebody answer me in the comment section below? What are actually better, french fries or tater tots? For whatever reason, lately, I've been going mean hard rocking with tater tots. I don't know why, son. Tater tots are just that wild potato crisp, light poppables. I mean, you could just take a bite out of a french fry, but tater tots, you can have fun with them. Mm. Now, Sonic's Tater Tots, these joints right here, they put enough salt on these joints to take it to the next level. You know what I'm saying? But they're flavorful. They're crispy. Light brown little boo things. I mean, you really can't possibly go wrong when you want a little quick snick snack. You can snick snack on some tater tots all day, family. Mmm. I don't know if it's because I'm hungry or what. But these joints are slapping today. Wow. Sonic, I give you tater tots a four and a half. Mmm. 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 Break out this receipt piece for y'all. So the one chop house um, cheeseburger combo, nine seventy nine. I uh, got a medium shake churro, two sixty. <laughs> And the tater tots, oh, mm, mm, got sneeze, ain't coming out. The Sprite, two ninety nine, came out to fifteen thirty eight, uh, dollar thirteen on that tax piece. Came out to sixteen fifty one. Mm. Wow! All right, y'all. Let's go ahead and take off this burger diaper. We know what it is. Oh, 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 hold up, it's holding on. 
I like to see it holding on for dear life. I do like to see it. I like to see the little jungle gym of cheese. Let's go ahead and expose that thing. So here it is. The brioche bun. And I really believe a brioche bun just kind of sets off any chicken sandwich, any burger in the flavor department as being that first bite. Like that first line of foodie defense happens right here in the bun game. And a brioche bun soft, buttery, toasted. This is chop house action. All right, got them onions in there. They said uh, the chop house aioli sauce, right? So I'm going to assume the flavor has to be ridiculous. But um, uh, what are you thinking, family? Please hit me in the comment section below. Let me know if it's looking appetizing or uh, smash or pass. Just say smash or pass on Sonic's Chop House Cheeseburger. Mm -hmm. I might have to hold it in because I don't really think I want to make a mess like that. So let me just go ahead and uh, give the cape a nice little wrap on the cape. I'm going to let you go ahead, fam. Go ahead, blue shirt, you get that first bite. White shirt with the stripes, go ahead and get your little nibble nibble on. All right, Miss Green Top over there, Miss Green Top. Go ahead and rock out. Get that little side over there for yourself, boo-boo. Get that side right there. Pinky up, affects the flavor. Mm. God! You were just forever disrespectfully nasty, dog. Can't even stop, fam. I just took a big bite into a butt full of yuck. Uh, this burger a munch. Yes, I'm a hater, won't eat it for lunch. Whoa. The only thing good about this burger happens to be that brioche bun for flavor. I don't know if it's a mix between the saltiness of the patty that aioli choice that they went with. I did get a light crisp from the onions, won't hate too hard, but it's just not a flavorful bite, fam. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, like I, I won't even spend too much time on that for you. Let's go ahead and close the casket. This needs to be a closed casket situation. I'm sorry. Y'all know how we do, family. If you know around here, stay true around here. We're about to have a closed casket funeral for the Chop House Burger here at Sonic. For my foodies out there, please understand when you roll up on a burger that just doesn't meet your maker and your wanting, your craving, your understanding of a burger that's supposed to be succulent, juicy, and divine, seasoned up all to be damned with the cheese cascading down upon the heavens when you drop onions. Onions, bro. When you drop onions on that burger, the onions is not supposed to play with your emotions. It's supposed to be crispy little boo things, especially if they've been fried, not just the raw butt onions, but the fried onions that lay right above the cheese. So when you take a bite, you're getting a flavor on top of flavor. That beef patty will set it off the right end or wrong way, unfortunately. For Sonic's Chop House Burger, this thing needs to be chopped. It needs to be cut from the whole entire show. Take this thing off the menu. This thing gotta go. When I tell you it's a two boo boo to foo, I'm not playing with you. I'm getting right to you. I'm looking at you in your eyeballs saying that this burger needs to fall. It stumbled. It dropped the ball. It kept trying to pick it back up. Going on the run, it got nowhere. This is the Chop House Cheeseburger here at Sonic. Sonic, you keep playing yourself in the food game like this. I don't know what you're doing. Stick to something basic like a hot dog. Burgers really are not your thing. They never were your thing. Let's just keep that 100% real. Your thing is drinks. Why don't you make a drink burger? Just name the drink after a cheeseburger. We'll understand where you're going with it. Call this one right here Cheeseburger Freeze and all of this is a drink. You know, ooh, my goodness, it tastes like a burger, but just don't give them no more burgers. We cannot take any more burgers from Sonic. This burger right here is the epitome of disrespect for one's taste buds. This is the type of burger that slaps you with without knowing you. It doesn't even call 
call you when it wants for you to come over. It just shows up to your house unannounced. You don't even open the front door. You think witnesses are out there. My bad, Joe. My, my bad. My, 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 my bad. I want to, but you know what? Even though I gave that joint a two, I should have gave it a negative two. I gave it a two. Doesn't mean it's going to stop me, though, from beating y'all in the head with the new churro shake. Yeah, you see that churro piece right there? There's a cinnamon. Whipped up loving right here. Mm-hmm. Give me a second. Un momento, por favor. Mm. Oh. So much flavor. You are cool and you are refreshing. You taste like a thick, rich churro in the form of a milkshake. I get all the definition on the flavor right there. I'm bold and cold, sweet and seductive cinnamon is letting me in for the win. I like it. Mm. If Sonic can't do anything right else in this world, they can do a milkshake. They have the best milkshake, hands down. Psh, hands down. If you try to put anybody's milkshake up against Sonic, they're going to lose. I'm telling you now. Sonic, I, you, I'm trying to help you save some money on product. You know what I'm saying? At the distribution center, tell them we don't want no more food. All you want, all you, you just drinks, dog. You're drinks. I'm looking around. I'm looking around. It's not like you're packed. You're not packed. But your drinks are crazy. So the people that are coming, they're coming for your drinks. Any little ice cubes. I'm, I'm just like, mmm. I'm going to be drinking on this all day. This right here. Is a five all day to play that burger trash. Don't even worry about that. Let's act like I didn't even review that. Let's act like this whole review was about the churro, the cinnamon loving. Let's talk about how refreshing that is when it goes down and just again, the flavor pops on you. Late night sparking up fireworks. That's the kind of pop you get. Mmm. It's your main man, Dame Drops. With another super official food review, baby. Sonic, please stop playing. Your tater tots are good. Keep those on the menu. When um, tater tots do slap, just serve up tater tots and drinks until I can find something else that I like on your menu that has anything to do with food. Because right now, this ain't it. Yeah. 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 Yeah.